So you want to add your own original music or audio or anything that you've seen somewhere online into a reel, but how do you do that? Let me show you how in this video. So we got to start by finding the audio that we want to add because we're going to record that. I'm going to have to record a screen recording of the song being played. There we go. So in order to do that, I have to swipe down and then right here I can press screen record. So you can see I can press down and I can start recording my screen. However, if you don't see this screen record option on your phone, you have to add it to your control center first. So to do that, we're going to go over to our settings and in our settings, we're going to go to control center. So you can see screen recording is right here. Let's remove that and let's add it. So if you don't have it added, it will be down here. So screen recording, press plus, and now it's here. So now I can use it. So let's go, see, it's available right there. So let's go back over to our YouTube video and let's start this before we want to record, before the music starts. So let's say we want to start so we want it to start like right here and let's start recording it. So to record it, I'm just going to go back over here and I'm going to hold down this screen recording. The thing I want to make sure of is that this microphone is on. So typically the default is to have it off. So instead I want to press it, make sure it's red and make sure the microphone is on. Start recording. And now I'm going to go over to my video and I'm going to be quiet and I'm going to press play. Okay, so let's say I recorded that. I'm, once I'm done recording, I'm going to press this red icon in the corner and it's going to allow me to stop the screen record. Okay. One thing to keep in mind for this is that your video clip needs to be at least five seconds long. So make sure that it is at least five seconds long or otherwise this won't work. So now I can access that clip. So if I play this, so you can see this is the whole video, the whole screen recording. What I'm going to do is I'm going to press edit and then I'm going to trim to the, only the parts of the video that I want the audio from. I want to hold down this bar. If I hold down on this bar, I can indicate where it's going to start. I can use this play and pause button on the end here just so I can have like a clear indication of where it starts and stops. And then I can move the back to where it ends there. If I hold it down, it's going to give me really fine tune um, controls so I can adjust it by the second so I can cut it when I need it. And then I just adjust that end bar to go to the indicator. Ah, I just missed it by a second. You can move that white bar as you're playing it to go wherever you need it to go. There we go. And so once you have the audio set, you're just going to press done. And you can save this as a new clip, but then that's going to create two clips. So you're going to have the original clip and you're going to have the um, new clip. So maybe if you want to use multiple audios from one recording, that's good. But otherwise, it's okay just to save it as a video. Okay, so now to add it to Instagram Reels, you're going to go into Instagram. You're going to make a new reel. You're going to click on audio and import. Now you see your songs going to appear there. Done. You add it. And so now it is saved there. And so now I can record the video that goes along with this. So you can hear as I'm recording this, it's playing that same music. And then another thing you can do is you can rename your audio. So name it to whatever you want. So before you post it, see here at the bottom, it says rename audio. You can add a name to, you can add a custom name to it. So Ghostbusters, MMC, it says, give your audio a unique name. You can only rename your audio once. So once you rename it, that's going to be 
what the audio is and so now if anyone wants to share it, it's going to have that name now you just press share and you're ready to share your reel with original audio i hope that that was really helpful for you and that you're able to get creative and have fun with this because the world's your oyster you can now use any audio clip to create instagram reels and remember messy action is always better than no action until next time peace